Good morning. Yo's people. Uh. Uh. So I just smoked two lots of CBD. Um. I didn't want a coffee. Um, it gives me anxiety. Um, uh, I think I'm going to have to edit this. Because there's going to be a lot of gaps. Um, my story was one of... Um, triggers irrelevant... Um, because when I was, this is my story in the past, when I was expecting abuse of people for being transgender, um, that's what I used to get. Um, And I don't, I don't really feel that that is really what's going on. I feel that, I know how in my video I said that I get mania once a year. And it's true, I do. I get crazy mania once a year. But um, normally I have mania. I have anxiety um, that people are going to treat me mean. Um, and it's like a medical condition and, um, I take drugs now and I get left alone. Um, I'm really looking for that special person out there. Oh, oh, and I find it interesting that people say like, oh, that special person, because like there's, there's got to be lots of special people out there. Um, there has to be. And I feel like this is a trigger warning and it's about depression. Um, I feel that depression, all I can do is tell it from my story. That way I can't offend anyone because everything that I say is true and it's true for me and um, it's my story. But like with depression, there's like an isolation. Um There's, I mean, I could do it the, the easy way and just say that, you know, stay in bed all day, don't have any friends, don't socialise, don't be fucking with anyone. Um, Just not having the energy to do any of that. And um, what I needed when I had depression was to be around people who understood me, be around people who would listen to what I say, people who would say interesting things that I would listen to, people I resonate with, people who 
um, have my vibe because I have my own vibe um, and to be around other people who have my vibe. Um, it's like a cure for depression. It's just finding the right people because there are a lot of arseholes out there. And um, fucking with pe fucking with assholes is just gonna cause depression. It it that they're, they're abusive relationships and they're gonna hurt. It's about finding people who are respectful, who don't take advantage, you know, and things like that. And that's what's so depressing when. Everybody I've fucked with has taken advantage of me, you know, it it's really depressing. But like there's a there are different worlds out there, different worlds with different people in. Some are depressed, some are very happy, some are um some are really living a dream. I mean it may not be like they've got like stacks of money, um I was having this conversation before how like money doesn't bring happiness. Um, what brings happiness is actual happiness itself. And happiness itself can actually help to manifest money. Um, but um, not just money, but money, friends, um, lovers, you know, etc. <laughs> Um, oh, oh, so, <coughs> that's a CBD that's making me cough. I can taste that I've got a chest infection. Either that or is the taste of the CBD. Um, I'm leaning towards doing a bit of maths this morning. I've got A-level maths. Um, and I could start it in September. I do my exam in June or whenever the exam is. Um, I would like to get into a good uni. I've got an A in chemistry and I want to get an A in maths. Um, so get into Cambridge or somewhere as a mature student. Um, that's a whole other video. Um, because I don't want to be working too hard at uni. Um, when I did chemistry at Reading, I was working round the clock and only having six hours sleep every night. Um, and it was... There was no social life, zero social life, and um, it sucked. Well, I, I wouldn't really say it sucked. I mean, it... It was okay. It really was okay. And I don't understand how, like, um, being at uni and working 24-7 can be, like... I can have like a, a good mood, like a lifted mood while while I'm doing that. I don't understand it, but it is true. Um, what I want to do is engineering, design engineering. Um, I've designed a petrol engine um, and I want to build it. So I want to do design engineering. 
I don't know if they'll have a workshop with the um equipment in that I'm gonna need, but I can always travel. Um, I think they'll let me travel to somewhere where they have those facilities and that I can do it there. That's what I want to do. Um, yeah, so I'm going to end this video and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.